A funny thing happened during the recording of a recent episode of Pixel Tunes Radio between myself and my co-host, Ed. Listen here to find out. So let's talk a little bit about Yasunori Mitsuda. I mean, we've, we've covered him on the show before. Yes. Obviously, most famous for composing the Chrono Trigger series, but uh, he started in 1990, spent a few years at Wolf Team mostly doing sound effects before joining Square in 1992. While there, he did some more sound effects for Final Fantasy V, The Seventh Saga, uh, Secret of Mana, and Romancing Saga 2. He composed two games for Square, Chrono Trigger, which he co-composed with Nobuo Uematsu, and Front Mission Gun Hazard. You're saying Chrono Trigger? I say chrono. You say chrono? I say chrono. That's weird. Chronology. Chrono. Chronological. Chrono. Chrono trigger. I mean, but, but that's, that's the, not how yeah, it's pronounced it's in English, No, his though. name is chrono, though. His name is chrono. No, it's not. It's chrono. It's C-R-O-N-O. Prove it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's right here on Wikipedia and wiki. Well, it's Wikipedia. That doesn't mean it's true. Listen. Anybody can... I will, I will go to my shelf, grab my Chrono Trigger box, pull out the manual, and show you that his name is C-R-O-N-O. Oh, I know how the, it looks. Right, but the game is based on his name. It's not necessarily based on cr- chrono, cro- like chronological. Right, I know, his, and I know his name is based on the word chronological. This is hard corpse all over again. <laughs> <laughs> we need some proof. We need somebody, we need a video, if anybody can provide on, on our Facebook group, a video from somebody from Square right. talking about the game and uh, pronouncing it Chrono or Chrono. I need, we need to see this. We need this. Because this, now yeah. we're going to, we're going to come to blows. It doesn't matter. This. I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to say it's Chrono. Yeah. Chrono. And I'm going to say it's Chrono. So. Yeah. yeah but you're wrong. Just, so. You know, if I'm wrong, I'll, I'll change my pronunciation. <laughs> I'll be the bigger man here. <laughs> Today begins a new chapter for the channel, for today we'll all be fluent in gaming linguistics. In episode 1 we'll be diving into an often pondered but never answered question. How does one pronounce Chrono Trigger? Most people, including myself, have called it Chrono, but there are others who call it Chrono. But why is there such a big mystery behind this? And where is the hard evidence with an answer? Well, this one may be a bit tricky, but let's dive in. Chrono Trigger is one of the greatest Japanese role-playing games to ever hit the Super Nintendo. I remember being obsessed reading about it in Nintendo Power, and it got me hyped enough to get the game when it came out while I was in 7th grade. Growing up, I'd always called it Chrono Trigger. But why? Was it a regional dialect? No, because there are people in the state I grew up in that also call it Chrono. The argument I always had in support of Chrono comes from the name of the main character. His name is Chrono. Yes, that's right, it's missing that H from the title. So, is this correct? Well, supporters of the pronunciation Chrono say it has more to do with the title and themes of the game more than anything. Chrono supporters believe that because the game's entire plot has to do with time, that the name references the word chronology. And since this word is pronounced differently, does this mean that the reference to time is accurate? I mean, it's even in the tagline for the game, Chrono Trigger, it's about time. Ha! Get it? When researching on the internet, you get mostly a ton of angry people taking one side of the argument or the other. I searched long and hard for a pronunciation directly from Square Enix. I even reached down to the original translator of Chrono Trigger. But at this time of the recording, he has yet to reach back out to me regarding an answer. So, we're back to, no pun intended, Square One. Gamers have been at war for this one for over 20 years, but I personally believe I've cracked the case, thanks to our friends at RetroWare TV, as well as some helpful people on Reddit. A few years ago, RetroWare Square TV published an official Japanese commercial from Square for the original release of the game in Japan. Take a listen to the pronunciation here. Chrono Trigger, Yuyaku Campaign Dish Square Soft, Shin Hatsubai. In the Japanese language, there are three different alphabets hiragana, katakana, and kanji. Katakana is used for foreign words that don't easily adapt to the native hiragana or kanji. An example often taught in intro Japanese courses is the word Coca Cola. Here, the words are pronounced Coca Cola since there is no L in the language. Here, we can clearly make out the voice actor saying Chrono or 
Kurono if you break it down. It's also important to keep in mind that chrono is what linguistics call a morpheme. When a morpheme, or a tiny piece of a language, is by itself, it would be considered the base. This means that when you have the word chronology, if you drop the ology suffix and just drop in an o at the end, it doesn't make the word chrono. A great example of this is given on Reddit during a discussion in which the user Gabe Degrassi Dawkins pointed out that the word psycho is part of psychology. The pronunciation remains held without the H in the word being pronounced, yet the O at the end is heard quite clearly, psycho. This can also be referenced in the title Chrono Trigger, since Chrono is the name of the main character and there's no H. However, the Super Nintendo version of the game was limited to five letters per character, which was later corrected in the Nintendo DS version of the game. However, in each version, the name Chrono by default is maintained without the H, even though six letters are possible on the DS port. We also tend to use silent letters for plenty of words. Unfortunately, there's a lack of 100% hard evidence from the developers, so in the end, it may just boil down to speculative discussion regarding linguistics, but that's why we're here today. Now I want to hear from you. Is it Chrono or Chrono? Has this video changed your mind one way or the other? Leave your constructive comments down below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on Gaming Linguistics.